Hello and welcome everyone to the walk around video here at your next car, the 2018 330EM Sports Saloon. Vehicle is presented in Estrel Blue, features the warranty body enhancement kit. As you can see we have also got the brand new 20 inch M Performance style alloy wheels. They come with four brand new tyres. At the front there you'll see the LED headlights. Being the 330E that is of course BMW's plug-in hybrid version of the 3 Series. So what does look like a regular petrol fuel cap is however where you'll charge it charge the vehicle up that's nice and simple car does of course come with a bmw charging cable once the vehicle is on charge it can be left on charge to its own devices it takes around about three to four hours to charge the vehicle from stone dead flat now that will vary of course from where you are charging it from and how you are charging it inside is virtually the same as a regular petrol or diesel model 3 series However, you've got two extra buttons, which we will, of course, talk you and show you more of in a moment. Got the Black Dakota leather option seats in this car. 3C Isofix rear bench. Centre folding armrest. And again, it's all been kept very, very nicely. In terms of vehicle range, now BMW give a claim range of around about 28 to 30 mile of range in the this year E-Drive. Now, again, that will vary on driving style, driving condition. We've got the gloss black rear boot spoiler and rear diffuser. The only real compromise of an E-Drive 3 Series is the boot space. You do lose a slight bit of depth due to, of course, having to store the battery pack in the boot area. However, this one does come with the split folding seats. There is that supply charging cable that will come with the car. And again, it is really, really simple to charge that. It uses a three pin household socket. And as I've mentioned, you can just leave that even overnight if you wish to, because once it's finished charging, the charger will turn itself off. Round at the driver's side then, again, everything looking nice and neat and tidy. The Astro Blue does always look very strong with the in-house enhancements, especially on the E-Drive cars. Very, very popular colour combination. There you can see having that, that split folding seat option is just going to give you that a little bit more space. And we'll go through and take a seat inside the car so we can go through a few more functions and features and we'll get the car started up in terms of the interior functions and features then we've got cruise control speed limiter voice and volume functions paddles for the eight speed sports automatic gearbox which is sorry it's a seven speed in these vehicles not the eight speed that you'd normally find to of course work alongside the plug-in hybrid capabilities the car's covered just over 50,000 miles, which again, for an e-drive of this year and mileage, the year and type of car, sorry, that this is, is about expect where you'd find it. Up here then, we've got our business navigation and media. We've got Bluetooth telephone and Bluetooth audio. We have also then got DAB, USB and Bluetooth audio. Two extra buttons, one not really worth talking about, that is to open the fuel filler cap. The other one is, of course, worth mentioning. This is, of course, how you will select your different e-drive modes. You've got automatic, max and save. Auto is self-explanatory. That allows the system to control which mode you are going to use. And if it is in full electric, petrol or, of course, combined. And then if you're going to max, that is, of course, when you have enough electric charge stored, it can run on pure electric. And save mode is running on pure petrol energy. To of course allow you to save your stored electrical energy for a time that suits you best moving back into automatic for the time being then and into the vehicle service status of the car not your service for 12,000 miles service history you can see there we've got two recorded services it also comes with bluetooth telephone and audio as you've seen dab and lastly we'll go into the servicing information not due on 12,000 miles and there are two on there so again there is a look around at this very very interesting e-drive 330e m sport if you would like to know more which will of course also include prices and funding options do please click the links that are left in the description and that way you can check out the car on our website for now though thank you very much for watching this walk around we do hope you've enjoyed it and found it useful thank you again take care bye bye